Our project in southwest Turkey aims to restore key refuge areas for native fish species along 500 kilometers of coastline. This is critical habitat for the Mediterranean monk seal, as well as sandbar sharks, loggerhead turtles, dusky grouper, and seagrass meadows. But overfishing and habitat damage through unregulated boat mooring, combined with increasing numbers of invasive species entering the warming seas of the eastern Mediterranean through the Suez Canal, have resulted in declining fish stocks and smaller revenues for local fishers. With funding from the ELP, our project will work to remove the barriers to natural ecosystem recovery. We will scale up to landscape level, a successful model from Gokoba Bay, where enhanced protection through designation of key sites as complete no fishing zones and the banning of fishing, industrial fishing in fragile nearshore areas has resulted in dramatic increases in fish biomass and also fisher revenues. We will work with communities and the government, and we're very honoured to have a colleague from the government here today, to designate additional protected areas to create a network of connected sites throughout the ski seascape. We will expand the existing community ranger system that works in partnership with the Turkish Coast Guard to establish effective enforcement mechanisms. We will support small-scale fishing cooperatives to increase the value of edible invasive species and promote better market access. Importantly, we will work to establish sustainable financing mechanisms through fish levies at cooperatives, voluntary contributions by tourism businesses, and the establishment of a social enterprise to manage an existing mooring buoy system, all to generate funding for ongoing conservation actions and to ensure that the seascape restoration is viable over the long term. Thank you.